What's happening? New episode of You Know the Apple. Myself, Dixie. Made a real Cockney chef. East London finest. And we are in fucking South London again. I feel like we're spending a lot of fucking time down here. But we're in South London and we're going to Bagel King, one of my favourite places after a night out. But it's the middle of the day and we're going to find out. I want to get Starkey's perspective well, you on You know it. why I want to go there? Because the bagel shop in Brick Lane, I want to compare it against the old salt beef. People going on about it, you've got to give it a it's go, haven't you? Fucking, that's a big um, standard yeah, it's a bit, to yeah, hold it is. It's like going from Canvey Island to Beverly Hills. <laughs> but, so, but, we're going to fucking find out, yeah? Let's see, eh? Let's go. Up the hammers. Just come out of Bagel King. Starkey has gone for, he can't eat no well, more, I've so he's gonna a, take well, his I've own. I've got the chicken ticker, but I'm um, the chicken I have a little look, it's upside fucking down as well. <laughs> I'm going Australian on that one. I can't eat right. no fucking more of it. About uh, I told Starkey, I told Starkey this is the one, right? This is the jerk chicken one, right? This is what they're known for, old Bagel King. Before rave, after rave, this is the one. To tell you the truth, we was walking down the other day, it was like the fucking wild west. <laughs> I'm gonna give you, I'm gonna give you a review of something I've been eating since I was 11, yeah? Mm. <laughs> what do you reckon? It's nice, it's exactly the same as what I've been eating. Yeah. <laughs> but, there is a thing, yeah? Starkey said about taking his own. I've done it where I've took these on. You can't do it. No. It's messy, you have to, you, it's really nice. It's to, all. To tell the truth, I could eat you now, but I'll ship myself on a train. <laughs> Quite easy. You know what I mean? But one thing I'm gonna ask you, would you, right, think about on a Saturday afternoon, getting the kids together and going to them, I'll tell you what, I'm gonna take you down to Bagel King <laughs> for a little treat. <laughs> to be honest with you, right, either that or you'd get a fucking meat wagon and an armoured van with you, because everyone looks like they want to have you up here, don't they? Yeah, it's not the most inviting place. No, well, well I can't remember. But I don't really know no different. No, I'm not in the wife, to tell the truth. But, but I'm just saying, for the family day out, would you bring them down here? No, but food-wise... You're enjoying it. If you're going to eat it there, in the motor... Yeah. I'll give this a fucking seven. Yeah. Right? Well, I ain't had none, but... You take it home, it's, you, I've done it, I'm telling you now, you can't do it. No. Right? What did you think about the old gaff? No, you know what? When I went in there, the people were fucking fantastic. I asked him, can we do a bit of filming in there? He was happy with it. And like I say, it smelled fucking lovely. But you know what? I've had half a fucking today. I've had half of fucking Southeast Asia. <laughs> I've, got, I've gone right through it today and fucking hell. But I'll tell you what, what do you reckon though about it? Look at that, it's all fell apart. Yeah, it looks shit. But <laughs> to be honest with you, the presentation is like fucking Artex in the Listen, 80s. I don't really want to even eat it on camera because I ain't got enough fucking tissues to get on the train <laughs> afterwards with, bruv. But in the comfort of my pal's motor or something, night out or something like that, it is a bollocks. I would tell everyone to go to Bagel King and get the jerk yeah. and cheese. Yeah, oh, do you know what? I can imagine you've had eight Stellas and you're falling through the door. That'd fucking be fantastic. So basically, realistically, this ain't for you, is it? Do you know what? I love the bagels. I go down Brick Lane, Salt Beef and that. But that's jerk. what I would say. That's yeah. what I would say. These bagels ain't the same as there. They can't ever be the same as there, can they? True, true. What are they, the American bagels? They're going to go on the camera, you've took one bite out of it. Yeah. I don't really want to eat this on, on the camera. It's fucking really messy and that. But in my own experience, yeah, I'll have a little film. If you are hungover, you just come out of down the road Ministry of Sand, or you've come out of Woosh, big up the Woosh, Woosh crew, this is where it's at. Right now, we spent a long day eating, a lot, a lot of stuff. Right now, I don't know, in the middle of the day. I've never done this sober. No. You know what I could do? I could easily find someone who's homeless and got a pair of gloves on, and they, they might have it. But to tell the truth, it wouldn't be my... So what are you giving it out of 10? Uh, I know you ain't going to taste it, but will you... Uh, you know what? I'd give it for presentation and that, like a 0.5. <laughs> no, like a little fade. I'd give it a fade. Do you fade. know what? I was really excited about bringing Stark here, because this is something that I, I, I do all the time. But 
I don't know if it's drunk, isn't it? Yeah, I don't know if it's in the middle of the day this experience here, but I'm not gonna lie to you. This ain't really cutting it, but I'm gonna give it on the other 20 times I've had it, and I'm gonna give it a seven. That's that's perfectly fine. But you know what? Even the cameraman today, he didn't want to get his camera out there, and he did it. It was gonna go off. <laughs> But you know what? It's because we're in the dirty south and we're from the east, but looking at it, yeah, no, nah, it won't be for me. <laughs> well, really.